Here is a story of a young man who was told he cannot, but discovered he can. He traded in his paper, silver, and keys to his chest in exchange for a pen to map out his quest. He started drawing a shape the size of his hand, which turned out to be a beautiful, faraway land. He would party with the locals when the stars were above, drink their drink, dance their dance, and sometimes find love. He would continue to draw whatever came to his mind, taking with him his heart and spirit leaving only fear behind. His adventures were great epic chapters to share, trailblazing not only the nation's land, but her water and air. His mind, body, and spirit united. There's nowhere he couldn't roam, he may have been born and raised in one place, but the world is his home. He took with him some items to place on his shelf. While others saw them as decoration, he saw parts of himself. Some friends thought him to be crazy at the end of the day, but those same friends were around when needed anyway. He learned when death is so distant, we set living off to another day. But when death could be near, we live without any delay. He continued to travel through the highs and lows, traveling as far as the eye could see. For when you get there, you can see further, or so the saying goes. He made friends as he went, of different colors, shapes, and size, though he noticed something similar in all of their eyes. 195 nations before 30 was his dream, always has been. But on his 30th birthday, his wish to do it all over again. He is spending little money and filming the epic journey, of course, to help you realize the world is neither his nor mine. The world is yours. <laughs>